is Di from Bags for Bubbles and I thought I would share today what I got for Christmas. So I wanted to share the gifts that I got from my husband, from my family, from friends, and also gifts that I got to myself from myself for Christmas this year. So I will try to make this as quick as possible. I also showed what the girls got for Christmas over on my other channel, Be Mommy with Style, and I'll link that down below. And also gifts that viewers sent to our Be Mommy with Style PO box. So I'll try to link that video as well. So it was a great Christmas. We had a really lovely, nice laid back Christmas. Hopefully you had a great holiday. And I typically am one of those people where, you know, I'm so busy running around getting gifts for other people. I don't like have a huge wish list, but I did um, do a couple special things for myself this year. So first things first, so I don't forget it, I'm wearing it. This is the necklace that my husband got. It's from Tiffany. It's just the three ring necklace. He asked this year that I send him a um, list of a couple different items and then he took my daughter with him and they went and picked this out. So that was um, what I got from my husband and then this is the little bag that went with it. And then we also had some Target gift cards that are down at the top from a family member because they knew that we shopped at Target a lot. So those are gonna be really handy. I also got this beautiful big bag from Sephora, which had some makeup items that I asked for. My dad is adorable. He goes into Sephora and then calls me on the phone and gets my wish list and has someone take him around because he doesn't know any of the brand names or anything. And then they always put together this really nice box of goodies that has all kinds of uh, samples and things to try. And I really like this gold this box. I may hang on to this for a little while. And I also got a Sephora gift card. Yay! And I also received a Sephora gift card from a um, mommy swap that I did with YouTube with a mommy group that I'm in. So I'm going to be doing some Sephora shopping and I will share that in a video with you guys coming up shortly. So I was very excited for all my Sephora goodies and all the makeup is already upstairs and being used. It was basically just like replenishment stuff like concealer and stuff like that. Um, but I will definitely share my Sephora haul that I get with my gift cards. So then I also got this very sweet little box that says Forever Friend. I literally was like, oh, when I opened it. It's a really cute little wood box and there's a little heart down in here. And I got this from literally my forever friend. So we have the same birthday and we just, we get each other. And I don't know, we just get each other. She is my sister through purses. We met through purses and now we're just forever friends. So I like literally was like, oh, when I opened this because I was like, that's perfect. I thought that was really, really sweet. I also got Starbucks gift cards, which I've already used and gone to Starbucks. And um, then I showed these in a different video, but I wanted to show them over here too. Um, I got this little potato head ornament, which I thought was cute. It's even got the openings on the back. And then um, this little L'Occitane set. This, cre this hand cream I absolutely love. I'll probably with my gift cards get the big size of this, but I love these for my purse. And it came with some really great scents down inside and a little perfume and then a really pretty bag as well. So we had a lovely, lovely Christmas, but a Christmas can't go by without me doing some shopping for myself. <laughs> So um, I did get some things for myself. So first of all, I ordered things for my kids off the Disney Parks app or Disney Crazy Family in case you didn't know. And one of the things that I got for myself that I'm just going to randomly like move around my house is this little Lumiere. It's actually quite heavy. I almost hit myself in the face with it. Um, it's a candelabrum. These really light up. Let me see. We'll just do this. Yeah, there we go. Hooray. So these really light up and he's actually really substantial. Like you could whack someone over the head of this. Um, but anyhow, I thought he was really cute. We love Beauty and the Beast at my house. And so this was one of my Christmas gifts to myself. I also got this bell mug. I collect these mugs that they um, look like the princess dresses and they have their autographs down inside. And so I got that as well. And then I got this cute little thing to display in my kitchen. It's just one of the little like candied apples. I just thought it was really cute. So I got all those off the Disney Parks app whenever I ordered some things for my girls. And that was part of my Christmas gift to myself. And then I also got this cute little phone case, which was kind of like a Christmas gift to myself, kind of just because I needed it because we got new phones. So this was kind of a Christmas gift for my husband, but we would have got new phones anyways. 
but you can call it a Christmas gift because it was around Christmas. So we got the iPhone 6 and I had to get a new case. And I love this case from Kate Spade. It's got the cute little polar bear. And then the stars are little rhinestones. So they like sparkle under the light. I love it. And then when I ordered that, I also got this little poof for my bag. This is Halogen brand. It was only like 20 bucks. It was really reasonable. Then this is kind of like an unboxing as well. Let me get this huge box over here. So I got this box from Henry Bentle. And um, I haven't opened it yet. So this is going to be like an unboxing if I can manage to not knock the camera over in the meantime. But what I got from Henry Bendel was two different jewelry cases. I gotta get rid of this box because it's massive. It's so pretty wrapped. I love, I love Henry Bendel. I absolutely love it. So this, I know what these are because I ordered them for myself, but they're both jewelry items. This is a travel jewelry case and this is a travel jewelry, no, it's not travel. It's a like little jewelry box that sits on your desk. I like hate to even unwrap these because they're so pretty. I love this paper, but I really like the stripes. I just thought it was, I don't know, very unique. My jewelry box got broken. I have my big tall one still, but my little one that sits out on our dresser broke during our move. So I needed something to replace it. And so I saw this. And it's just so pretty. It's nice and shiny and lacquered. I don't want to blind you because there is a mirror inside. But it's got a tray that lifts out and it's got these built-in trays underneath. Hopefully you can see that without being blinded by the lights. And then it's so pretty and lacquered. And then it's got this cute little puffball key that goes on the outside. I'm a sucker for keys on jewelry boxes. So anyhow... I just thought that this was really beautiful and unique, and I thought that this would be a great Christmas gift to myself. And then the travel bag looks similar, so it's kind of like you guys are getting to watch me open presents. This is like an unboxing as well. Um, and it has the stripes, and it zips around, and it's just a nice big open area. I had one that was more set in on itself and I kept losing things in it. So I'm hoping that this may be a little bit more organized. So it's got the different snaps and different things for earrings. So that's what that looks like on the inside. So we'll see if that works. So both of those are from Henry Bendel and these were two of the from myself to myself category. The other thing that I got for myself, I might as well just done a separate video for this stuff, but that's okay because we're already going now, is from Tori Birch. And I again had this year a very lovely friend who was able to get the 30% off friends and family sale coupon code and offered it to me. And the deal on that is you can use it on anything, even sale items. So, or there's a couple exclusions, but it's it's not very many things. So I had been eyeing a couple handbags, and I got myself this handbag, which happened to go on sale right after I got the code. So I want to say regular price was 400 and something, and I ended up getting it for like 200 bucks because it went on sale for like 332, and then I got 30% off of that. So my math may not be exact. But this is a really cute little satchel handbag in the color Bark. And I really like the detailing on this. It's a little bit different. I was looking at this one and one other, and I eventually ended up settling on this one. So hopefully it was the right choice. It doesn't have the name on here. But I thought that this one was cool because it had zip details on the side. So you could kind of expand the bag a little bit. You can see it's still all wrapped up. But um, it's got the two handles that are all leather. Smells really nice. And then it's got a longer strap that I can wear crossbody. So I thought that this would be something unique for my collection. I was wanting something in this sort of tone, this sort of color for my collection. So this is kind of what jumped out at me, and it was a really great deal, a really phenomenal deal. I'm very happy with the quality of Tory Burch handbags. So I'll do like a review on this coming up and I'll have all the info about like what the retail was and what the actual name of it was. But this is part of my Christmas gift to myself was this Tory Burch handbag. And then 
I also, since I had the coupon code, I don't think that these were on sale, but a couple years ago, my favorite sunglasses got lost at Disney World, and I never found them. They were Tory Burch. And they are the oversized T-Hinge sunglasses, and I decided I was wanting to replace them because I've tried forever to find like a different style that would be like similar, and I finally decided I'm just going to get the same thing again. So these are ones that I've had before. I think mine were just slightly different shade, but they fit perfectly. I love it. They just, they don't touch my eyebrows and they don't touch, they just, they hit all the right places. So they honestly have another color of these, a navy and a cream, and I may go ahead and just go ahead and order those as well because they just fit my face perfectly. Yay, I'm so excited. This is the first time I've gotten them out. So I got these sunglasses and they were like 150, which is really good for the quality. I'm again, very happy with Tory Burch quality. They're made by Luxottica. I just saw the paperwork in here somewhere. Yeah, they're made by Luxottica, which is the same company that makes Chanel sunglasses. So honestly, they feel exactly the same as Chanel sunglasses if you've had those. So um, for me, I am very happy for the quality and the price because I got these for around $100 because I had the 30% off. So it was really quite a good deal. So hopefully I'll like the color on these. This was a tortoiseshell color. I think the ones I had before were just like a dark brown, um, but this was what they had available, either this or the navy. So that was the other part of my Christmas to myself. So I think that is about it. If I forgot anything, I'll put it in a video upcoming. But that was my Christmas in a nutshell. My girls had a very, very fun Christmas. I filmed, we do all of our vlog videos over on Be Mommy With Style. So we vlogged on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. So if you want to see those, I will link those down below. And they're over on my vlogging channel, which is Be Mommy With Style. So going forwards in 2016, we are getting settled in our new house in Michigan. I am very excited to be inspired in my space here because it's been a while since I felt like that. I'm excited to be talking about all the girly things that I love, handbags and makeup and accessories going forwards in 2016 and sharing all that with you guys and just trying to get things going on both channels. So I know that kind of sometimes in the past couple years have focused a lot on being mommy with style and then you guys were kind of left hanging over here. But really one of my goals for 2016 is to be able to balance it out and be able to do some videos that are for my own enjoyment over here and talk about things that I like to talk about. So not that I don't like to talk about things that I talk about over there, but it's all more practical stuff over here. All the fun stuff's over here, right? So you guys know what I'm talking about. So hopefully you had a wonderful holiday. Thanks for watching today, and you had a wonderful start to 2016, probably by the time that you are watching this. And I will see you in a video very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.